Hello everyone, today we'll show you some registry tweaks related with DirectX of Windows. DirectX is developed uh, from Microsoft, it's only for Windows obviously, and the most games are supporting uh, DirectX. So, this registry that I will show you today theoretically can improve performance. It's different uh, game by game, it's different by si system by system, so the results not gonna be the same for everyone. So, let's explain now the two registry. First of all, we have two types uh, of this registry. The first is for AMD and the second for Intel. The only difference is uh, multimedia extension fastpath. This is this uh, specific D word is developed from Intel in order to improve uh, operation of GPU uh, in the games, improving multimedia multitasking uh, and uh, graphics performance. Okay, the rendering of graphics theoretically. Uh, Obviously, AMD has something similar, but this video we're not gonna show something similar. Okay, so if you have AMD CPU, don't execute uh, direct 3D tweaks. Intel, okay, run, execute the AMD. This is the only difference. The other things are the same for uh, all CPU. Okay, now let's explain every single uh, big word of this registry. Starting with... Uh, Table video memory PBS. When this value is set to zero, it allows to use uh, the use of video memory for creating temporary vertex buffers graphics. This can potentially improve graphics performance by utilizing the graphics card's memory efficiently. Uh, multimedia uh, uh, extension fastpath, as we said, is developed for Intel. It's only for Intel CPUs and especially for modern CPUs. Uh, that's optimized uh, multimedia and the graphics processing using MMX instructions in modern CPUs and this can uh, improve performance in graphics uh, application and multimedia. Now about flip, no vising, disable frame rate synchronization during screen flipping. This can increase frame rates in graphics uh, applications, potentially improving performance. However, it may lead to visual issues like screen tearing when two frames are displayed concurrently. Software only, this registry and determines the graphics driver support software rendering only or not. In theory, enabling software rendering can be a fallback option for improvement compatibility that may reduce performance compared to hardware acceleration. And the last is emulation only. This registry entry specifies whether direct draw support is provided solely through software emulation or not. In theory, enabling again software emulation ensures direct draw functions are available even when hardware acceleration is not present. However, this may result uh, in reduced graphics performance. Starting with system latency, I did 5 tests uh, and here we have the average, here we have the before, here we have the after, after I execute the registry. Um, I must say that the results looks better before, but as I said, no any particular improvement with direct 3D tweaks in terms of system latency. Okay, basically we can't say that we have any improvement, any increase or decrease latency. Okay, so... Uh, in system latency, we have zero uh, difference, okay? And as you see, the module driver is direct kernel, okay? Let's see now the Valorant latency. Okay, the same pattern, uh, 10 tests, and as you see, the average results are so close. Can't say that we have any uh, important improvement, any important reduction with latency. Uh, yes, we have lower numbers duration uh, in uh, duration fragments max and average but again i can't say that we have improvement okay especially in uh, dpci surrender time so uh, in terms of latency we can say that we have something important to discuss okay the latency is basically the same still the same so it's basically normal i think because i tested the system latency not uh, first case is obvious because we not play a game but on uh, that case, uh, Valorant obviously using DirectX, but uh, we can't say that we have an improvement, okay? Anyways, it is what it is. What it is. Now, in terms of FPS, I did again five, uh, 10 trials, sorry. And the results again, basically the same. Okay, uh, basically it's not the same. We have 10 FPS uh, in, uh, in both cases. But uh, if we see uh, more uh, carefully the results, uh, more unstable, I think. Uh, the, 
after I, I execute direct 3d tweaks, so I don't know. This it depends the game. Some games can accept this uh, registry and improve performance. It depends how every game uh, using uh, uh, DirectX, so we can't be sure. Maybe in Fortnite we can see improvement, maybe in CSGO, maybe every game in Call of Duty, I don't know. You should do your own tests. Obviously, I can't to test every single game that uh, is existing. Okay, obviously, I can uh, add some games uh, in the future. Perhaps I will add Fortnite, maybe, or CSGO, I don't know. But uh, in Valorant, we can say that we have some improvement. Results are worse, more unstable, according to my results, okay? Especially 1% loss looks really bad in some cases, okay? Anyway, so that was the video.